Wearing a mask during the coronavirus pandemic has become a hot political issue for those who do and those who don't. It's helped fuel even more myths, and that's why we're giving you just the facts. Like this one, wearing face masks could lead to carbon dioxide poisoning. This conspiracy theory has circulated across social media recently that the carbon dioxide we exhale can get trapped inside the mask. Physicians say as long as your mask is breathable, there's a very low risk of poisoning from the exhaled carbon dioxide. Since the mask is not airtight, the gases you breathe out can escape through cloth and surgical masks. The mask is designed to make sure that respiratory droplets from coughing, sneezing, or talking by you or someone near you who is infected with the coronavirus don't get through the mask. So the simple truth is, no, wearing face masks do not lead to carbon dioxide poisoning. But doctors say the much larger issue is wearing masks incorrectly, like here on the neck, also with gaping holes in it, or on your chin or below your nose. These are all examples of putting on your mask the wrong way. How well you wear the mask has a huge impact on how much you spread the virus and your risk of catching it. So it needs to cover your nose and go under your chin. You wanna keep it tight enough, that not that it hurts, but that it's gonna be a little bit snug as, so you keep it as well fitting as possible. Dr. Daria says washing your hands before and after you take off your mask, those are key in helping prevent the spread of the coronavirus. And those are just the facts.